Well, Vancouver's Queer Film Festival started yesterday. It is the second biggest film festival in the city, with about 13,000 people attending each year. The opening screening at the Playhouse Theatre sold out, but if you didn't manage to snag a seat, there's still plenty more to come. The festival's going to show more than 80 films from around the world. We spoke with Executive Director Drew Dennis about what's special at this year's festival. A particular focus uh, this year at the festival is a spotlight on Russia and, of course, looking at what's happening in Russia now with uh, newly introduced state-sanctioned laws against gay propaganda. It's really creating a different uh, landscape in Russia for LGBT people. Our centerpiece gala uh, film is one of these films that we're bringing in from Russia. It's a documentary called Children 404, and it really is uh, an underground film that illuminates the determination of political resistance. Uh, Alina... Klimova is an activist who created an online forum for LGBT teens. So essentially with these new laws, what's happened is it's pushed LGBT people underground or invisible. So the, the reference to the title of the film, Children 404, 404 is a message when an online page is missing or not found. So that's the connection. But what's incredible about this, uh, about this film is we see, um, we hear these stories from some of the LGBT uh, teens that are bullied, that are harassed. And of course, it goes unchecked. Because now, you know, the state has sanctioned that that type of behavior can happen, that people can harass uh, and bully uh, gay teens. That's Drew Dennis, the executive director of the Queer Film Festival, talking about the festival's focus on Russia this year. The festival runs until August 24th at venues across the city.